Hi all and uh, welcome back to a small help video. Today we are going to look at Apple CarPlay and I have some tips and tricks if you're not able to connect your phone to your car and make it work in the car. So here are the tips and tricks that I have used myself and also what is mostly recommended by Apple. So first of all, let's have a look at the cables. I have a normal cable that I connect my iPhone to my car with and I have experienced if the car get too old and you have used it a lot of times then the cables are getting a bad connection so try with a new cable uh, before you do anything else take out the, the old cable get a new one and plug it into your uh, car if you use the cable to connect to your car so this is one of the most common issues that the cable has simply broken. So replace that one. The next one is you also can have a look at your uh, connection port or the uh, power connection down here where you put in your cable. Sometimes it gets a little a uh, bit dirty because of you have your phone in your pocket or whatever. So make sure to clean your charging port down here to get all the dust and dirt out of it and uh, also make a hard blow to get all the dirt out of your charging port. So those are the two first things you of course need to do. Another thing is of course also to have a look and just simply reboot your device. Make sure to restart your phone so it is fresh and clear, so you don't have a lot of memory that is not uh, available on your phone and therefore the connection can be bad. So have a look at that and do a restart of your phone. Then the next thing is of course to go into the configuration for CarPlay. And in here you should be able to see your car name and uh, if it is not connecting then a good thing could be to go into your car name and in here there is a button called forget this car. Just simply press that one and uh, then click forget. Then it will forget and it will then make a new connection to your car. So that's a good thing to do. And then you of course have to connect to your car and make sure that it is approved. So that is also a very good thing and a smart thing to have a look at and under here you can also do a lot of different customizations that is what is actually available when you have connected your phone to your car so that is also a good thing to have a look at and maybe take out some of the apps you don't use anymore in your car and another thing that is also very good to have a look at is the screen time and it is under this small section and down here we have the content and privacy restrictions. So when your phone is connecting to your car and you don't have it opened and you are locked into your phone, then uh, you need to allow Apple CarPlay to be used. So in here under content and privacy restrictions, there is allowed apps. And in here you have a long list of different apps and services that you have available on your phone. And down here you can see we have a CarPlay configuration that you can turn on and off. Simply just make sure to have it on. Another thing you can also do is under here if you don't want to use any of these content and the privacy restrictions, you can simply just turn that off then you don't have any restrictions and then you will be able to use Apple CarPlay. So uh, hopefully that is something that you can uh, use if you are having issues uh, connecting your phone to your car. Before you go and try some of these tips and tricks and solutions that I have shown you, then uh, I also have a personal experience with uh, the Apple CarPlay and that is if you do not have your Siri enabled and is working as expected, then you will not be able to connect your phone to your car. 
So make sure that your Siri is up and running and is working as expected. If not, then you will not be able to connect your Apple CarPlay with your iPhone. So make sure your Siri is configured and is working before you connect your iPhone to your car. So these are the most common uh, tips and tricks. So uh, always have a look at your wires. Always make sure that your power uh, adapter entrance is clean. And then of course, make sure to have your restrictions turned on or off actually. Uh, and of course, go into Apple CarPlay and in here, try to forget the car and see if you are able to connect your phone again. I hope uh, this was some uh, helpful tips and tricks. If you have any questions, comments, please put it in the comments underneath this video. Hopefully you can also give me a thumbs up if you like the video and uh, subscribe to my channel for more help videos coming out soon. Thank you and